Welcome to Kermit Uncut. I am here in the toilets of the Green Note Club in Camden for a reason. I have this theory that every single part of my life is somehow interconnected, even if I don't know how at the time. One of my favourite bands when I was growing up was a band called Yachts, who I absolutely loved. I saw them live loads and loads of times. And when I was in Manchester, I adopted the name Henry after the leader of the Yachts, which is Henry Priestman. Years later, through the miracle of Twitter, I ended up meeting Henry Priestman. In fact, here he is. This is Henry Priestman, who I've just met for the first time about half an hour ago. Yeah, we met on Twitter, but we only met We only met physically here, which is yeah. really great. And I'm about to play bass for Henry at a gig, which he's doing for the launch of a new record. However, when I was on the stage, you know, doing my sound check, I looked over, and who should I see in the audience except for Mark Herman, Yes, Mark Herman, the director of Brassed Off, Mark Herman, one of my favourite films of all time. So, Mark and Henry together in the toilets at the Green Oak. <laughs> You've known each other for ages, right? I didn't know seven. that before. I think we met, I was seven. You yes. eight? Yes. No, I'd like to think I was seven as well. Oh, sorry, yes. So you just a little bit older. <laughs> so did you, were you going to be a musician before you were a filmmaker? No, oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no, no, no. Songwriter, though. Of Song note. Writer, yes. Chart Songwriter hits. Songwriter since. You wrote chart hits? I wrote, I Ideal wrote, World, you can't write Ideal World by the Christians. So Will Smith rather than that musician. And were you involved with the Chuddy Nuddies as well? No. That was well, you were in the same from, school, yeah. Same school. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So, an audience, I was an audience. Does it help having a musical bent when you're making something like Brass Off, which incidentally is still one of my favourite movies, and it's a soundtrack album that I play in the car alongside Yachts right. Records Off. whenever I'm going on a long drive. Right. Does it help? Yeah, does it help to be musical? Uh, yes, because uh, actually writing that script was constantly playing brass band music to help me through certain scenes. So you wrote it, it with the music? Playing, playing as I was writing. Yeah. Why do you think it is that that film's lasted so long? Because every time I turn on the television, it's playing and everyone loves it now. I think it's remained topical for 25 e years. Even more topical now. Yes, yeah. it's... Yeah. It's still there, it still matters. You know, there are still communities that are being trodden on just the same as they were 25 years ago. Do you look at it now and think it is a, a, a work of genius, or do you only look at your own work? <laughs> <laughs> but it is, oh, I love that film well, so much. Well, it's doing the rounds again now, because we do, we do this live, uh, live the like, Grindful Band play live to the film. We take, oh, yeah. we take the music off the film, and they play live to the film. Wow. It's a whole new experience even for me to watch. Yeah. Just, it's a terrific experience. And which venues have you done that in? We've Big done venues? We've done the Albert Hall, and we're doing the Albert Hall again, and again next year. So the Albert Hall particularly relevant, because the film itself... We never, we never filmed at the album. I know. We never got there. Where, where did you use so, to stand in uh, for the album? Birmingham. Okay. Birmingham Town Hall. And we went to Birmingham to do this thing again at the end of the week. So that was the weirdest experience, was seeing the end of Brast Off, where it's set in the album hall, sitting in the album hall, watching it. It was really oh. weird. Are you working on new stuff now? Yeah. yeah right. Can you give us a hint of what it might be? I better not, because it turns fade. Okay. Yeah. Henry? You're out on the road again, which is fantastic. Yeah. Tell me how much you love Brast Off. I love Brast Off. I was at the premiere. Oh, yes. No, no. I mean, we're, we're saying we. I mean, he's my best friend. He's my best friend. Yeah, best man. I was, I was oh, I was. And he, yeah. I, I decided to get married, and he rang up ten minutes later saying he's going to get married. And could he be my best man? So we've known each other for ages. Mark's co-written. Two songs on the new album, Ghost of a yes. Thousand Fishermen, which yes. we will play to which has done a fabulous So you video. might be playing one of my songs, is that possible? No. no. That, I, you know, I tell you what, no, I will sort that out so that I do, because I feel that would complete the circle, because as far as I'm concerned, this is like all the different sides coming together in one glamorous toilet. Don't let anybody tell you that this is the most glamorous world. Ideal world. A bit of harmonica in C. You've got to see harmonica here. I can do that, yeah. Let's you want to play it. across in C or straight C? You see, you said this on an email. I've, it's, it's right I'll play it in C. Right. I'll play it in C. It'll be fine. We'll be fine. How hard can it be? 